Me? Okay. Hello, everybody. I'm uh, Valerio Fisolo from uh, ProtoCube Reply. And uh, thank you. Someone know me? I'm, uh, I'm here for the sixth time in the, in the Blender conference, the second as a speaker. And uh, this year, we are, uh, with the ProtoCube uh, Reply, we are also sponsors of the conference. So I'm here with uh, my uh, works mate, uh, Fabio, Laura, and Adi. And uh, he's a part of our team uh, of design uh, in, uh, in ProtoCube. Yeah, we have, um, we have a mission in our job uh, that uh, is uh, to solve a uh, client problem uh, and uh, develop their business by means of the um, most advanced 3D technology. Few words about uh, our history. Uh, Protocube Proto was born in 2006 as a rapid prototyping company. And uh, we... Uh, uh, our product was a tangible experience, uh, like a 3D printing object for architecture or a product uh, visualization in a scale model. And um, we use Blender since uh, 2009. And uh, today, uh, prototyping are, um, bec has become uh, virtual. So also the product are moving to a digital experience way. So digital experiences uh, are uh, made of many parts, uh, like uh, virtual reality, augmented reality, web 3D visualization, and uh, product customizer. Uh, so why we love Blender? Because um, we can link it with many different software for each specific uh, project. Uh, now I uh, will show you a little uh, showcase of uh, our works made with Blender. After that, uh, Laura uh, will uh, talk to you about uh, our last project uh, made with uh, Blend for Web. Thank you. These were some examples on what we've done with Blender, but now let me introduce you to the main topic for this speech, which is a particular project called Fixed from Limits to Possibilities. One year ago, we met our client, Danilo Ragona, which is a very brilliant designer and a very active and outgoing person. He has a lot of ideas and works on many projects at the same time. And he is in a wheelchair. So, based on his experience, he started to think about how to improve the design process for products for disabilities. And in particular, with his experience, he noticed a gap in the market for this kind of product. I mean, can you see these pictures? Uh, often, uh, these kind of products are very similar one to the other, and we can notice a lack of aesthetics, and you can't customize it. So you can't uh, go in a shop and buy some parts and then mount it on your wheelchair. You have to go uh, through the traditional medical channel. So this is the challenge for this project. Uh, Danilo uh, started to, to develop a new project and created a new brand called Able to Enjoy, which focuses on designing for disability. 
Um, as Danilo says, if you think that disability experienced on a wheelchair is a limit to a full, fun and colorful life, be prepared to change your mind. So the main challenge for this project, uh, for this project was to try to transform uh, previously viewed as a medical product into a fashion one. And uh, Danilo tries to develop new ideas on this particular topic. And so let's see how we've done and then we can speak about the details. This is what we came up with at the end, a new e-commerce with a 3D real-time uh, customizer based on the blend for web engine and on Blender, of course, for the 3D modeling. Now let's see step by step some of the key points of, for this project. Starting from 3D modeling, we used the low poly modeling uh, kind of work and used modifiers and shape keys in order to be able to modify the shapes uh, freely and easily if needed. Then we create uh, the 3D models starting from photo references and from a real prototype. So we create each part uh, separately and then we create a hierarchy in order to create connections and dependencies between parts. Uh, the, part the special feature of this project is that you can choose your components on a wheelchair uh, according to your needs. So for example, if you have to go to the seaside, uh, you need something stronger than tr the traditional wheelchair, and then you can buy the fat wheel and mount it on your wheelchair, and so you can easily move on sand and other kind of terrains. Um, starting from uh, this point, we go through the shaders and texturing phase. Uh, we were able to elaborate each material and each part with a particular material scanner, which gave us uh, uh, diffuse, normal, and displacement and specular maps uh, as outputs, so we can uh, realistic uh, preview the model. The shaders are quite basic, basic because uh, the, um, Danilo asked us to have a, um, a simple and uh, free uh, interface and also an agile interface. Then we uh, started to work on the APL control setting up because we wanted to change dynamically the color and connection between parts and also we need to change uh, components such as the wheels and so on, the brakes for example. Uh, so we made use of the RGB value node provided by the blend for web engine and so we are able to control it with uh, a simple HTML interface and uh, some codes uh, of JavaScript, uh, some lines of uh, JavaScript code. 
the main challenge for this project was to uh, real-time preview the, customiz the customization uh, because uh, um, people have doubts about buying this kind of product outside the medical channel. So they want to see exactly what, are, what they are going to buy. Uh, if you say you are an extreme person, you want to see which means in, in terms of setting up of your wheelchair. So with these particular controls, you can change parts, change wheels, and all the parts are connected together through the uh, use of constraints and modifiers. Also, uh, shape keys, uh, for example, for the part uh, on which you put your feet. And this is the real challenge of, uh, of this work. Talking about user experience, um, have you ever seen or tried the product configurator, maybe online, some of you? Yeah, of course. If you have, you probably found yourself in front of a lot of choices, a lot of selections and sections, and maybe you didn't know where to start from. So we think about providing a little introduction to our customizer in order to guide the customer in his customization flow. So you can say if you are prudent, active or extreme, and a color you like, and you can start with a preset, uh, your configuration. You don't have to start from a blank project, which is always scary <laughs> because you don't know where to go. Even the user interface was uh, uh, designing in a clear and simple way. You have to know what you're going to do. We have to, you have to know always where you are. So on the right, you have a little list of the sections uh, provided by the system. And then we uh, use the big arrows in order to suggest the customization flow to the user. Even the colors are dynamic because if you select a part, the system shows you enable or disable the colors in base of your, so on your selection. So you can't mis make mistake and choose colors that are not <laughs> uh, possible to buy. So as you can see, we reached the goal because these photos were taken during a charity event called Modelle Rotelle in Milan this year. And uh, as you can see, each model has uh, his uh, wheelchair paired with his dress, uh, dress. So is there anything more fashionable than fashion itself? I think no. This is the, the main goal of the project. We, uh, we managed to transform this kind of medical product into something different, something new, more comfortable, more functional, and also more beautiful, if you can say. And I want to thank my colleague Giovanni, which is in uh, Turin, in Italy, and uh, who worked on the code part for this project, but he's not here. And <laughs> so, hi, Giovanni. And then if you want to talk with us about something, these are the main topics we are dealing with in these moments. So for example, if you want to talk about real-time technologies, such uh, as uh, um, something based on WebGL or Land for Web or Verge or Eevee and so on, or maybe about uh, offline render, we are here, we are four. And so if you want to talk with us, feel free to say something. Maybe about you on what you have done, or if you have some suggestion for us, feel free to talk with us. We are outside. And now you are able to enjoy. If you want to try our customizer, you can scan the QR code or visit these websites in order to try the experience. And so thank you for your attention and enjoy the conference.